Good morning, everybody. We're out here at the lake today. Gonna get started here in just a moment. Fishing with my buddy Ethan today. He's right there filming a little segment for his channel. Um, so we're gonna get out on the water. Not really anything in mind in particular today. Just gonna go out there and have fun. There are musky in this lake, so maybe we'll get into one of those, but not counting on it. Well, anyway, let's get out here on the water. Ethan's on the board. Oh, yeah, that's all I can catch. Yeah, we're on the board though. That's what really matters. There you go. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But like, as a. As I was reeling it in though, it was just like... <laughs> so I kind of felt bad and slowed it down a little bit. Alright. I love this little micro. Dude, you gotta get yourself an ultralight. I do. That's another... Oh, that's a bass. Hey! First of the right species. Not the right size, but... It's a largemouth nonetheless. There he is. Oh, another bass. Not a big one, but. Upgrading in size. All right, we got him on hook there. Getting better in size. Look how fat he is, though. He got a little belly on him. Little, little fat fish, feeding up well on those little minnows. And we'll let him go. Go get bigger. All right, so I haven't talked about it yet, but today we're throwing this. Still throwing a Ned rig. Uh, worked well last time we were out here, but I switched it up to the TRD hogs instead of the, just the regular TRD. Um, a little switching up a little bit. Got the PB and J color there, and see if that'll work. It's been working pretty well so far. I would lose it. I'd freak out. I'd probably fall out of my kayak. That one feels pretty decent. There we go. Hey, doubles, doubles on deck, doubles on oh. deck. Hey, rock bass guy. That's a pretty good one though. <laughs> Honestly. Rocky. Here, catch. <laughs> All right, so of course, okay. Ethan gets a largemouth, I get a rock bass. That might actually have been about the same size fish. Oh, hush. <laughs> we'll yeah, let him go here. All right, another rock bass. What's new? Try not to. I'm almost hitting the jet ski here. Well, you know, just trying to run into some boats. Another rock bass. Trying to swim even though he's not in the water. That's that's cute. Get him back. That's a little largey. There he is. In my last video, I was fishing with the TRD Shrooms jig with the skirt, and I didn't catch anything like this. So I'm thinking that that skirt helped kind of eliminate the, the mini size, but today that's all we're catching, so I don't really mind. the anchor. There we go. Close up your whole leader, didn't you? Almost. Oh! 
decent one? Yeah. I mean, for what we've been catching. Feel it all the way to the tip, why don't you? Oh goodness, he's biting, man. Yeah, good fish. Let's get in the boat. Help over there, bud. We got him. That's a nice one. Yeah. Easily the best of the day. And of course, I get a rock. <laughs> no, it's a big old gill. Roberto. Nice. Oh, he popped off oh. because it brushed up against my anchor system. Dang it. Alright, well that's the best bass of the day so far there. He's, all these bass have been eating well. So, get him back in the water and uh, let him go grow. So, so I've got one hooked. I have to break off. Yes. I'm just screwed. All right, so by necessity, we have now moved into fishing a netherrig on straight braid. So let's see how that goes. Yes. Got doubles, yay. You got doubles? <laughs> Kinda. You got rocky? I got the rock bass. All right, folks. Oh my goodness. There you go. Ah, ah, ah. Our little guy. Okay. Alright, we got another little little baby rock bass there, but we are catching them on straight braid, so I guess that's encouraging. Rock bass. Ooh. You came dangerously close to poking your eye out. Be careful there, bud. Alright, we finally caught another largemouth. We'll get him back in the water. Got another one off that dock. Hey, it's one of them big mouth bass. Boat flip! Nope. <laughs> it's actually a decent fish. I mean, compared to what we've been catching today, not bad. Little bass there. Wow, that's a... Yeah, that's a pretty fish. Yeah. Come on, take it. There we go. That's definitely a rock bass. I can just tell by the way it bit. Another one of them rock bass, folks. Pull a little bass out of there. Ooh, that was dangerously close to poking that bass's eye out. You gotta be careful there, bud. All right, so I'm here editing the video and realized I completely forgot to film an outro while we were out at the lake. Um, so I'm just gonna kind of quickly recap what went down and add some little notes about it. Um, so yeah, we had a good time. Did a lot of finesse fishing, kind of flipping Ned rigs, that kind of stuff up under docks. Uh, Ethan is actually ch filming a little challenge video, so keep an eye on his channel, link down below for that. I think it'll be a really fun watch. As I mentioned in the in the intro, there were musky in this lake. Didn't find any, of course. If we did, I probably would have lost my mind, because there's no reason a musky should be biting a Ned Rig. Anyway, I did catch a warmouth, though, which I've never caught before. At least I'm pretty sure that's what that was. If you're a fish identification, identification expert, let me know if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure one of those was a warmouth. 
Um, but yeah, I had a great time out there. And if you liked what you saw, remember to click that subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell there for notifications so you know when I post a new video. But uh, until next time, though, remember, it's fish o'clock somewhere.